There's an adage in the National Football League. In fact, there's a phrase. You just keep on chopping wood. This was a wood chopping kind of day for the Kansas City Chiefs. Down 17 to nothing. Less than 20 minutes into this game, it looked like it was going to be Detroit or Buffalo all over again. Then it was 24 to 7 after a 41 yard slant from Castle to Bow. But Kansas City comes back with 21 unanswered points. And the key play, listen, there's another adage in the NFL. You find the runt pig and you go after him. Gerard Powers had just left the field with an injury. That put a rookie into the game for the Indianapolis Colts. And right here, right here, Steve Breston at this point takes it in, stretching out the football for the go-ahead touchdown. And Kansas City wins this game 28-24 with 21 unanswered points. There are heroes all over the place in this game. Matt Castle played like a pro bowler in the second half. So did Dwayne Bowe. He abused Jacob Lacey throughout the afternoon, over 100 yards receiving with tough catches and tough runs. Steve Braston played like he did with the Arizona Cardinals in 2008 because he now has become a great uh, compliment to Bo and Baldwin's coming up the next time the Chiefs play after the bye. The offensive line fought all day against two of the best pass rushers to ever play in the National Football League. On the defensive side of the ball, the Colts had scored on four of their first six possessions. It looked like it'd be a long day in here and Curtis Painter looked like Peyton Manning. But in the second half, the Chiefs defense made play after play after play forcing McAfee punts and the key play on fourth and six John McGraw, the 10-year veteran out of K-State, able to defend Anthony Gonzalez on a fourth and six play that gave the ball to the Kansas City Chiefs. This was, this was a gut check. This was a saw and wood kind of game. The Chiefs never quit playing and down 17 twice. The last time I can remember a, a comeback like this in the second half would have been against the Green Bay Packers in 2003 at Lambeau Field. And this win feels like two wins because the Chiefs get a bye week. And now after two wins on the docket, you get two weeks to get a surge of energy to go into Oakland and play a very good Raider football team. So give a pat on the back to all the heroes and the job they did here at Lucas Oil Stadium. And for Kansas City, it's a saw and wood kind of win, finding the runt pig right here. For KCChiefs.com and the great folks at Time Warner Cable, thanks to them. Of course, you can check out the Hall of Honor every time you go to the new Arrowhead. I'm Mitch Holtis, voice of the Chiefs, with a victory on the road in Indianapolis.